Hey guys, it's Kristen. So in today's video, I'm gonna show you how you can make a large Hershey Kiss, but using Rice Krispie treats. This is perfect for anniversaries or Valentine's Day, something that's a little bit different, uh, but let me show you what you need and how to make it. For this project, I'm gonna first make my Rice Krispie treats with uh, Rice Krispie cereal, marshmallows, and three tablespoons of butter. Then I will also be using cooking spray, tin foil, and different size funnels. You will also need a glass for each funnel, a heart cutout cookie cutter, a piece of paper, a marker, and some scissors. Now if you've never made Rice Krispie Treats, it's super easy. You start by melting your butter, then you will add an entire package of marshmallows, which is 10 ounces, and now we'll start mixing it. The important thing is to keep stirring constantly. You don't want to let this sit or else it'll burn um, or can change form. So make sure you're stirring this at all times. Then you're going to add in six cups of your Rice Krispies. Now mix it all around until it's completely coated with the marshmallows. Now while this is still hot, we're going to take one of our funnels and we're just going to lightly spray the inside and we're going to take some of our Rice Krispie and just fill the funnel. You might need to use your hands, but if you do, I highly recommend that you spray your hands as well because this will be very sticky. So we're just going to fill this all the way to the top. So at this point, like I need to use my hand, so I'm going to spray my hand. Just leave that there. Okay. And I just kind of rub it around my hands. And then what you're going to want to do is just pack this down. So this won't be super hot, it's just, it's warm. But you want to pack it now firmly, but to not too much. Because if you pack it too much, the Rice Krispie will turn hard as a rock. Now, we're going to take one of our glasses and we're just going to leave it like this, upside down. Um, because what can happen is sometimes the marshmallow will drip down. Um, it doesn't always do that, but just in case you want to leave it like this. So now while we're letting the Rice Krispie Treats cool, we're going to cut our piece of paper into strips. So I cut my piece of paper on the shorter width versus the uh, lengthwise so that this actually works out to be a perfect length because you want about, you know, about half of this to be inside your treat and the other half sticking out with your message. All right, so here's a quick example of just some of the messages that you can do and now we're going to start wrapping our treats. So now I'm going to take my tin foil. You don't need very much, um, but it will vary on what size your treat is, okay? But keep the shiny side on the outside, so the matte side should be on the inside. Also, don't worry about wrinkles because that's what they look like. Hershey Kisses are wrinkly on the outside. So we'll take one of our treats, and we're gonna just start scrunching it up like this, okay? Now leave a little bit of room for your message. So I'm gonna take this and just stick it right on the outside. You want it to have enough where it will stick out like that. Just kind of hang over. So mine's a tiny bit long, so I just cut about a, an inch or so off. So put it like that. And then you're just gonna start wrapping it to look like a Hershey Kiss. So I'm gonna shape it like that, okay? With my message going on the outside. And then here's my little message that sticks out. So now for our Rice Krispie hearts, um, we're gonna take our cookie cutter and I'm just gonna lightly spray the inside. Don't worry if it gets on your hands, you'll probably need some on your hands to deal with the Rice Krispies. Okay, and we're just gonna load it in there. So push firmly, but not too hard. And mainly focus on the edges. So like where the circle, you know, where the circle part is and where the point is, because that's where we want the shape. The rest of it is just like a circle pretty much. And then while it's still hot, I recommend pulling that out and then you've got a nice little heart. All right guys, so that's it for today's video. I hope you liked it and if you did, please give me a thumbs up. Also, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe and then hit this bell so you're alerted when I upload a new video. And I'll talk to you later.